here. And uh, big picks there, Ultrasonic helping out. And it's going to be fragged all across the board here. Rusty will take out six after a good call out here. He is the last player alive right now. Uh, no, Quake on five is, I'm sorry, on the other team. The bomb is down on him, so he's going to have a lot of work to do with the three on one situation. As we hear a lot of people going crazy, I think, for offensive combat, that's what they're playing right now. So, uh, good shots there by Rusty and Normal Boot. Uh, they're a little quiet right now. They are a little quiet. <laughs> I, I am impressed. Uh, Rusty 5-0 and right now, leading the way, putting the team as bad as we discussed uh, previously before. They do have a lot of experiences. They do have these spots uh, that they have already figured and seen and watched. Uh, very, very, very cool to see, though. This is definitely yep. something you see, especially in competitive gameplay. Uh, like I see on the ground. As uh, QuakeCon 449 able to take out 5 uh, with a nade. Uh, to put it down to a 4v4 situation. Still a minute 30 left. What? 4v5 is a, the, no one has fallen quite yet for the defense of the team. Oh. And now a 3, a 2 on 5 as more frags coming across the board and a lot of aggressive pushing right now as it looks like C3 really uh, living up to their team name of that. These can't come close. <laughs> yeah. I do apologize. It's fired and it is 0 3 now. Uh, looking pretty dominant. As uh, Rusty does actually finally get a death uh, chopped up, but uh, still, still they are just completely dominating right now. Yeah. It is 3 0. And it's going to be defense now for Team Normal Boot. So let's see if they can get something going here. Uh, it's going to be, it looks like a pretty quick push off the bat here. We do see the defensive setup as we are on board right now with uh, Team C3, as it looks like it's going to be a focus over at A. There is a good defensive setup for that, though. Ultrasonic with a good headshot there with the AK over the top of the balcony right there on the 75, who's usually one of the carriers, and they are actually right now giving a lot of good shatter for Team Normal Boot, as A, it looks like it is going to give you some big push right now, as uh, Kuryoku, who is playing on account 449, is going to be the one coming through here, trying to get a lot of frags in bomb side A. They are able to see the flank coming around for the other side of the map, and it is a two-on-three situation in favor of C3, who does have possession of this A bomb site at the moment. Yeah, and there is a minute and change left, uh, so now it is up to uh, them to uh, protect the bomb, basically hold on, hold out. Uh, it is a 3-0 lead, so uh, either it's going to stay going steamrolling right now, or they're going to get back on track. Yep. And the bomb, excuse me, uh, is planted in bomb side A, and it's up to just Quake on three. He's got to finish off this three on one clutch right now in order to get his team kind of uh, on the board right here. Uh, Quake on 449, that's Kuryoku right there, able to get that scoped and frag. And uh, I think they're kind of scratching their heads right now. They are smiling, though. I mean, they got nothing to worry about. Yeah. They are playing this game for the first time, and they are walking with 100 bucks a person. So yeah. this is all for fun right now as it looks like it's going to be a push closer to B side here. And as there is a good setup right now uh, for the defensive team of Team uh, Normal Boot. Good shot there from Quick out there from above and four from below. So a good hold of bomb site B as there's no support coming around as Immortal is still hanging out by the back of the spawn. One more hanging over by the bomb site over at A, which is where the bomb looks like it is going right now towards bomb site A. So maybe possibly a fake coming through. Ultrasonic on top of B. He looks like, oh, he will finally pick up that goal right there. Lots of trading back and forth. One player up right now. QuakeCon 4 is that player. He's down to 29 HP, and he is hanging out at the wrong bomb site. <laughs> Basically, that is what it is. But he is so low on health, but he does have to take it slow. The bomb is playing. He does spot someone, but wow, since he is so, so low on health, not really much he can do there. They are down 5-0 right now. Uh, but they're having a blast. You can just hear them enjoying There's the prone button. Their time. Good to note. <laughs> Just that, that shows that the fact that uh, these guys have not played long enough, they didn't even know that there was prone in this game. <laughs> wow. Uh, Asking if this is the best of one or best of three, uh, we might say just the best of three based on what we've seen so far. <laughs> this is going by a little quickly. Uh, we'll see what the guys at Normal Boots want to do. It is getting kind of late. Uh, I, I'm still or feeling early. good. Or early, depending <laughs> on how you look at it, yeah. Sun's probably rising. Yeah. Uh, here comes Immortal with double kill with a nade and the M4 over on the other side of the map as we do see 449 heading his way over by bomb side A. And it looks like Immortal was jumping around trying to get a third, unable to do so as QuakeCon 6 will hold off one, unable to finish that off though. A two on three situation in favor of C3. 
as uh, it looks like they will take over bombsite A. Ultrasonic with that good long range star play will be holding off the bombsite here as there's good play there from Quake on 4. And it is a one on one situation. Quake on 5 against Ultrasonic on bombsite B. It's Quake's on 5. Uh, and Ultrasonic over at bombsite A. He's playing pretty passive. He's actually in a really bad spot. If he has the pick behind him, he can get around. Yeah! 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 Look at this, look at these guys. They're going, they were going absolutely crazy for a second. They're just to get around from the closed beta champions. <laughs> so they're having a good time, uh, which is always good to see. Um, as I'm not going to have a uh, a good spectator here. We are in the middle of the map, so that's going to be pretty interesting to see. As the rounds will switch, we will have defensively or offensively playing Team Normal Boot. As it looks like it's going to be a push over towards Bombs today. They do get the opening pick, which is very big on Ultrasonic, who's been playing pretty well so far. He will be taken out for his trouble, though, as it's a trade back and forth again happening over at bombsite A. 75 is trying to distract over here at B. He does get taken out by Kuryoku, though, who's over there. I think that was Kuryoku. I can't tell which one of the two of them. And uh, a taunt coming out from 666. <laughs> what a jerk. And it is going to be a two-on-three situation. They're playing very passively on offense in this room. Oh, my goodness. He just nades. Right into yeah. that <laughs> They're putting him in the right spots. QuakeCon 4 is the last one up, and he will drop right there, getting the rounds to 6-1 to one in favor of the defending champions of the closed beta tournament. Can't come close. <laughs> yeah, this, it, is it, this is fun. This is actually how you think. And what's more important is these guys are, are enjoying themselves. They're having a blast. Um, here it is, what is it, 5 a.m. in the morning uh, on this yeah. last day of PlayCon. Uh, what a better way to finish it out with a fun game like RT Ooh, Combat, good name. highly competitive. Uh, it's, just, it's a blast, really. That was a really good little bounce state there from Quick on Six. That he did get the tag registry there, and they will get a push into one or A right now as Immortal is low and uh, one of the last players up around here to hold off this bomb site. He will get a pick though. That's a big pick right there for him, and he's going to be the only person over here by bomb site A. Eh? As they, uh, as a two-on-three situation, as Immortal was able to convert right there. Bomb goes down. He's able to pick up another one. He's only got Sid XAP, and he's able to get double kill. Looks like he was going to get the defuse as well. As there's just kind of a lot. Of confusion going on right now for Team Mormon Boot of what's going on. As you say, GG. And so Immortal getting as a 6 HP double kill to help his team keep that advantage right there. And it will be possibly just one more round right now as uh, Team C3 just uh, showing how experience does in fact matter. <laughs> yeah, experience. Yeah, I mean, it, but like I said, I mean, it's all about boiling down to having some fun. Uh, really just relaxing. They've already got some money. Both of them are champions of their respective, uh, respective tournaments. Yeah. Uh, regardless of this, the, the scoreboard here, uh, both of these teams, both the one here and the 